What is up YouTube, Penosa here. So today's video is about iWork for the iPad 3. iWork is a substitution for the Microsoft Office Suite, which is not available yet for the any iOS device. So this is available in the App Store as a suite all together, all three apps, Keynote, Pages, and Numbers for $29.99. And you could get them by themselves at $9.99 but if you've seen all my other videos I'll show you how to get them for free so it consists of pages, numbers, and keynote pages as uh, would be word, numbers as excel and keynote as powerpoint so we open up pages and as you can see it's all my documents you could edit them, create them right here email them to your computer or to whomever and they could view them as a either a PDF or a Word document, any way you want them to view it as. So you can check, um, add the, click on the add button, create a document, and you have um, a choice of many of these templates. Or you get the little blank one. We could do I don't know the syllabus. Doesn't matter. Random document. You can uh. You can even select so select this paragraph to demonstrate. So, no. Select the paragraph. Go to the paintbrush. We can have different heading styles. We can change the font size. We can make the 14. We can make the color green. We can put the font... Fitura. We can also go to the add button. You could add media, tables, charts, shapes, settings, the wrench, which you could um, change the. Oh, hold on. If you go to layout, you change the spacing. Double space it right there. We can also. Uh, center that we can bold it increase the font size we can change this picture replace it with I don't know how does that look introduction to convention Conversation of French, Mob the Dead picture. It's just a demonstration. So, um, if you go to the wrench, you can go to document settings. I mean, document setup, and you can edit the header. You could put YouTube or whatever you want in in any of the three boxes. So you could put the page number. You could also do the um the footer simply and you can if you want to change the font and or size for the brush, do the line spacing, the list, if you want to add a bullet or number, style the font, style bold italics on the line, different heading and layout obviously. And you want to add a media table ch uh, charts or shapes you could do that as well and you can just simply press done and we have our header and our footer which is introduction to conversation in French with the page number you can't see it here because we have the picture all the way to the top we can delete this as you can see we have the word count on, which is 392. To do that, you simply go to settings and you can have the word count on, off, and all these uh, spacing guys, edge guys, sensor guys, checking, check spelling. Spelling is very crucial. So that's simply just, um, um, pages. You could click on document, it automatically saves. And you, if you click edit, select the file, you could 
email it, open it, copy it, it can make a, uh, a, a duplicate of it, and if you click get it, you could also delete it, delete documents, and now we're going to go to numbers. Numbers is Excel. Um, if you click add, create a spreadsheet, you have all these um, templates. I also create this is I didn't create it as a template, which I did uh, right now. It's, this is just made up stuff. You can see our chart here, our pie chart, our info, our transactions. For example, we can double tap there. You can then choose the month, date, twenty-three year. Just made of stuff. We could put a uh, gaming or something. And then you could put the category. Depending on, uh, on, the on the presentation that you need. And then we put the bill. As you can see we have our currency here. as dollars, percentage, rating check mark and we're gonna do about $75 you click on the done button you could act, um, add the time you did it add text or equal but we're just doing numbers $75 done and right here we could replace gas with we could replace school with gaming and we spent our budget was let's say ninety dollars and we actually had seventy five dollars that we spent oops wrong one And then automatically the the um the totals differentiate and it's added to the chart like it would in Excel. You could change the title. You could actually if you select it, you could define that word personal. It gives you the definition. So I find it very useful. Uh, you can change the um like the text size, the style options, the purple, any color you want, the text itself, you can arrange it. Any way you feel like changing or doing, this, this is a perfect app, in my opinion, the iWork um, suite is very um, good when it comes to writing, creating, or just simply messing around. Using for school, especially for school and businesses, it's an awesome portable um, uh, apps. You can use it on your iPad. It's much easier to carry around with than a bulky laptop. This spreadsheet, you could save it. The same thing as Pages, you could um send it wherever you want. And Keynote is PowerPoint, obviously. For all of these presentations, either Keynote, um numbers or pages you could just simply plug in the adapter to your um device and you could mirror it to a tv a monitor a computer etc so this is just a small presentation that i just did in about a minute or so basically just to demonstrate what kino is you can change the settings i'll show you in a minute um basically right now it's playing by itself i'm not tapping or anything you can change it uh, by using a key remote um, or you could simply tap for the animation to go on or you know, get off at your pace. Simply right now it's playing by itself. It's just a uh, quick little uh, presentation that I just made up. 
some more opinions. It's just really simple. As you've probably seen my other video, May 21st is the new Xbox release or reve uh, revelation. And the release, I'm assuming it might be by November or December. Just can't wait for that. If it's worth upgrading or stuff. Um, I will be making a video. Uh, the review of the Autobox Defender series for the iPad 3. I did buy the cover uh, when the iPad came out in last year in March. I bought the Autobox black one because that's the only one they had. That's the first one that came out. And I have had it since m last year. And it's pretty beat up. And it's taking a lot of damage and stuff. But my iPad is still intact. And I will have the unboxing of a new cover. Maybe a color one. So stay tuned for that as well, guys. So as you can see, this is uh, one of the... Um, this is the end of the presentation. With Lara Croft and Zombies. This is my top two games right now. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 and Lara Croft Tomb Raider. It's uh, excellent. If you like um, adventure and shooting, Tomb Raider is like the best. Not only do you play as a girl, but um, it has a lot of action intensity. You're like, you sucked into the game. Is that is is that is that very interesting? It is very interesting indeed. Call of Duty, no words for it. The new Mob of the Dead is awesome. The uh, map pack, a DLC for the Uprising. It's excellent, as well as the personalization packs. I have the, uh, whatchamacallit, the Party Rock Edition. It's really cool. So, yeah, we're getting off topic, guys. This is presentation-wise. You can change the settings. Like I said, if you go to Advance, and you go to Presentation Type, you could do self playing Hyperlinks Only, Normal. Normal means, just like, for it to play, you have to tap the screen. Why do that when you can self play? And you could uh, change the delay and the build. I have set mine to one second for transition and build for five seconds so it could be fast right now. You could do it slower and you can loop the presentation or whatever. And if you have a remote, you link the remote that can control the keynote when print, uh, the presentation is playing. And you could actually have interactive hyper, uh, hyperlinks. And you can change the select the picture. All these little numbers, the yellow ones means going in. The gray, the black ones means going out. Meaning that going in is when it first comes up. For when it pops up, moving out is when it leaves. So we can change that. We have a little preview, with that photo, and you could change the order around. How you want it, if you want what image you want it to be first or second or last, whatever. That's pretty much it. You could also add media, tables, charts, shapes, text. So I think um, pretty much in depth I went in these apps today. So if you have any questions, comments, or uh, concerns about the app, I'm pretty sure you um, I work is best for you. I've been working it for with them since they came out and I really enjoy them for it's good for college like I said you could type your papers essays or whatever in my opinion they're great and just like I said guys stay tuned for the uh, unboxing of Autobox Defender I pretty have it maybe by next week hopefully it's um, the uh, cover should be shipping to me anytime this week so please comment like and subscribe guys until next time.